Always on. On air, online, on mobile. Fox Toledo News at 10 starts right now. Toledo Public Schools expects to get answers from the University of Toledo tomorrow. Good evening, I'm Laura Emerson. The school board president asked the university to look into how TPS projects its budgets. Fox Toledo, Sean Hegarty is here with where the district stands. Yeah, tomorrow we should hear that from the board president, Bob Vasquez, is going to be announcing those results. Now, the district always has to prepare a five-year forecast to make sure that they know where they're headed. And now this review is being done to make sure all of those projections are correct and everything is done on the up and up. And it, this wasn't a review to go through every aspect of the book, but to make sure that when a budget number is put out there, it's actually being done the right way. And this comes just about two weeks before TPS heads back to voters on a levy issue Bob Vasquez says he feels like the projections that they do right now are reasonable and consistent with all the laws, but he wants a neutral third party to look over those numbers, which includes a budget deficit of $44 million for next year. Here's what he had to say when that audit was announced. I think it's important that the projections are uh, as close to accurate as possible. It's a very difficult thing to do because it's, it's kind of the foundation for everything we do. It's the foundation for our budget. It's the foundation for uh, uh, negotiations. Well, part of what makes these budgets so difficult is that the district doesn't know how much money it's going to get from the state next year or even property tax numbers, which really determine the final numbers. I talked to school board member Lisa Sobecki tonight, and she told me that several people have asked to review the books. She thinks it's possible that some tiny discrepancies might be found, but she doesn't think people are going to find $44 million in discrepancies. Reporting live, Sean Hagerty, Fox Toledo News.